What's up my friends today? You are learning how to bubble flip, so let's jump straight in. Okay, so the foot position is as follows. You have that front foot with your toes hanging off right before the front bolts, and then that back foot I almost have right underneath the bolts, pretty much on the concave. And that is what you're gonna use to flip and jump off of at the same time. Now this is a very confusing trick, but it's gonna be a lot easier if you hit the like button first, so bear that in mind. But for reals though, the motion for this one is literally all in the back foot. What you wanna do first is practice the motions by taking one foot off the board and just practicing it with one foot kicking the board back and then forward again to get a flip because this is quite a complicated trick so it's going to take a little while to get this down so we're going to practice that first so what you do to get the flick is you pull down like this so you push backwards with that back foot and just where it's about to get to the point where it's up 90 degrees you're going to kick forward straight away and that's going to cause the board to come back and then flip straight forward so all in one motion it's going to look like this Try not to land on your other foot. Okay, getting it to flip straight is by far the easiest way to practice it. So just do this first. Get yourself used to pulling the board back with that back foot and then instantly kicking it forward to get the board to flip. This is what we call a kick back flip and it's a great warm up for the bubble flip. Okay, so now we come to the tricky part. So if you're struggling, you can find help in our Discord. Links in the description. The hardest part of the trick is getting the board to spin 180 and flip at the same time. So what you're gonna wanna do is watch my back foot movement very carefully. Make sure that you put all the weight onto your back foot and predominantly jump off that same foot. While at the same time going for the motions of swift kicking that foot back forwards and diagonally to get the board to spin in that same direction see as i kick back my foot almost goes off in that diagonal direction to swipe the board left to make it rotate now this is by far the hardest part of the trick so make sure you spend some extra time practicing this step now i recommend practicing this bit stationary because it is far harder to do it while moving so we're going to bend down kick back with that back foot and instantly after we kick back we're going to kick it forward and to the left to make the board flip and spin at the same time and then the board will hopefully kind of fall underneath your feet and you will land on top of it it's going to take a lot of practice but after a while you should start to see the trick to form and remember a key piece of advice is you have to be super fast and aggressive with that back foot if you're too slow or you take too long to do the motions it's just not going to happen you need to be fast and aggressive with this one and now trust me this trick took me a very long time to learn so you're gonna have to be patient although it is almost certainly guaranteed to get the homies in a letter and skate if there's anything else you need to know drop a comment i'll always do my best to help see ya